Have you ever wondered why the Titanic, touted as the unsinkable ship, sank on its maiden voyage? The Titanic, a marvel of engineering and the epitome of luxury, was born from the vision of ambitious men and the toil of countless workers. In the bustling shipyards of Belfast, Northern Ireland, this colossal vessel took shape. Larger than any ship of its time, the Titanic was conceived with an audacious promise to redefine sea travel and to make the perilous journey across the Atlantic not just safe, but lavish. It was a symbol of human ingenuity and the industrial prowess of the early 20th century. The Titanic was more than a ship. It was a testament to mankind's relentless pursuit of progress. The maiden voyage of the Titanic was awaited with bated breath. The world watched in anticipation as the unsinkable ship was set to embark on its journey from Southampton to New York. Aboard were over 2,000 passengers and crew, each with dreams of a new world, adventures, and opportunities that lay across the vast Atlantic. But as we know, the voyage that began amidst fanfare and jubilation would soon turn into a night of unimaginable horror. The ship, believed to be unsinkable, collided with an iceberg in the dead of night. The iceberg tore into the Titanic's hull, and the ship that was deemed invincible began to fill with icy water. The world was stunned by the news. Reports of the Titanic's sinking spread like wildfire, leaving people in disbelief. How could the unsinkable ship sink? The tragedy was a stark reminder of the hubris of man and the unforgiving might of nature. The dream of an unsinkable ship lay shattered at the bottom of the Atlantic, along with over 1,500 souls who perished in the icy waters. With the Titanic's sinking, the world was left in shock, questioning how such a disaster could occur. The sinking of the Titanic is not just a tale of a ship's demise, but a lesson in humility, a reminder of the limits of human ambition against the elemental forces of nature. Now, let's step back in time to the Titanic's maiden voyage. The 10th of April, 1912, marked a historic day as the Titanic embarked on her first and final journey. She was the epitome of luxury and engineering prowess, a floating palace designed to traverse the Atlantic with unparalleled grace and speed. On board were over 2,000 passengers, a microcosm of society, from the wealthiest elites to hopeful immigrants dreaming of a new life in America. As the Titanic cut through the icy waves, there was an air of invincibility. The ship was heralded as unsinkable, with its 16 watertight compartments and state-of-the-art safety features. This belief in the ship's invulnerability added to the shock and disbelief when the unthinkable happened. On the night of the 14th of April, the Titanic collided with an iceberg. The supposed unsinkable ship had met its nemesis in the form of a colossal chunk of ice lurking in the North Atlantic's frigid waters. Despite the crew's valiant efforts, the damage was irreversible. Water began to flood into the ship's compartments, slowly but surely sealing the Titanic's fate. Panic ensued as the scale of the disaster became evident. Lifeboats were launched in a desperate bid to save lives, but there were not enough to accommodate everyone. The ship's band played on, their haunting melodies a stark contrast to the chaos unfolding around them. In the early hours of the 15th of April, the Titanic succumbed to the icy depths. She had been afloat for less than three days. The once magnificent vessel was now a ghostly wreckage at the bottom of the ocean. In less than three hours, the Titanic had sunk, leaving a chilling silence in its wake. The grandeur of her maiden voyage had turned into a harrowing tale of tragedy and loss. Yet the story of the Titanic continues to captivate us a poignant reminder of our human frailties and our relentless pursuit of progress. What happened after the Titanic sank remains as haunting as the sinking itself. In the icy waters of the North Atlantic, the echoes of the ship's distress calls still lingered. The survivors, scattered amongst the wreckage, clung to lifeboats and pieces of flotsam, their lives hanging in the balance. Rescue operations were frantic and fraught with challenges. The Carpathia, the first ship to respond to the Titanic's distress signals raced against time, battling the icy conditions to reach the survivors. 
the crew of the Carpathia displayed immense courage and resilience, pulling survivors from the icy waters, their faces etched with the horror of what they had witnessed. Yet, for every tale of survival, there were tales of loss. Families were torn apart, dreams were shattered, and lives were forever changed in the wake of the disaster. The world mourned for the souls lost to the depths of the ocean, their stories forever intertwined with the Titanic's tragic fate. In the days and weeks that followed, the sinking of the Titanic dominated headlines around the globe. The world was captivated by the survivors' harrowing tales and the staggering loss of life. The disaster sparked an international outcry for better safety regulations at sea, leading to significant changes in maritime laws. Investigations into the disaster revealed critical flaws in the Titanic's design and safety measures, prompting a re-evaluation of shipbuilding practices. The lessons learned from the Titanic's tragic end continue to shape the maritime industry today, ensuring that such a disaster never repeats itself. In the end, the sinking of the Titanic was more than just a maritime disaster. It was a human tragedy that exposed the vulnerabilities of man's technological prowess and the strength of the human spirit in the face of adversity. The Titanic disaster left an indelible mark on maritime history, prompting changes in safety regulations and ship design. It serves as a solemn reminder of the cost of hubris and the enduring power of human resilience. The Titanic's legacy is much more than just a tragic tale of a sinking ship. It's a timeless narrative that has seeped into the fabric of our collective consciousness, a saga that continues to captivate our imagination and inspire countless books, films, and research. The Titanic stands as a poignant reminder of human ambition, audacious in its quest and tragic in its downfall. But it's also a story of resilience, of survival against all odds, a testament to the indomitable human spirit that shines even in the face of adversity. The Titanic story isn't confined to the pages of history. It lives on in every retelling, in every exploration of its wreckage, in every tribute paid to its lost souls. It's a legacy that transcends time, resonating with each generation anew. The Titanic story remains a powerful testament to human ambition, tragedy, 